finding a comfortable seat. Slow your breath down and then you can already begin to deepening your breath in and out through your nose. Arriving, breathing, and just allowing yourself for a few minutes to be very still and connect to your breath. Breathing in and out through your nose. And then take your arms up over your head, touch the palms and lead your palms down to your sternum. Forearms are parallel. Elongate through the crown of your head. Exhale to begin. Inhale. Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo. Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo. Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo. Atkrename, Jugat Kreename, Sat Kreename, Siri Guru Devename. At Kreename, Jugat Kreename, Sat Kreename, Siri Guru Devename. At Kreename, Jugat Kreename, Sat Kreename, Siri Guru Devename. And setting the intention to really concentrate on your breath throughout this short practice. Bow your head toward your heart. And then blink your eyes open and release the posture. You can change the uh, heels. And then we begin to place the thumbs just below our rib cage. And we begin with long, deep breath inside and outside the nostrils. So sipping the lips and begin to breathe. Trying to stretch the inhalation to four, expanding the tummy and then exhaling, counting down if you can to eight. Really pulling Uddiyana Bandha in. So your palms here are a good indication. So one more time. Good indication if you're really breathing in to your tummy and then let go. And sit up straight, creating the shape of a triangle, elongating through the crown of your head, very slightly tuck your chin and then we are continuing with Sitali Pranayama, rounding the tongue and begin to inhale. So while we are shaping the tongue, we are closing the eyes gently, rolling them up in comfort, looking at the pineal gland, the space between your eyebrows. And then moving the prana, the oxygen, up and down. Breathing in and breathing out through the tongue. And stretching the exhalation just a little bit more. And already here you should feel the changes we are making within our beings. All of us 
Breathing in and out now. And then hold now with your breath. Retain your breath. And lightly let go. And then come to sit in Upavishta Asana. Just separate the legs. Rolling the thighs in and extending. Now I like you to go in your own path. We begin to breathe together. We're inhaling and whilst we're inhaling deeply through the nose, the fingertips and the toes are really contracting. And then on the exhale, as we pull in through the Molat Bandha and the Udiana Bandha, we close. So we're working with the breath of fire. And keep on pulling up the bandhas and breathing deeply. You can roll the eyes up. Go as slow or as fast as you like, holding good posture. You can speed up if you like, but still pulling in and up and working with the breath. So breath is key, whatever you do. slowing down so if you're just learning how to do the breath of fire go as slow as you can inhale and then exhale the inhalation occurs naturally and inhale pull and then exhale inhale And now hold and then release and then take your hands underneath the back of your knees just going to do a little aura cleanser take your arms up and with the breath of fire and the eyes rolled up begin your breathing Keep your spine elongated, keep your arms long, energized through the fingertips. Now inhale, hold up, have your thumbs touching, retain the breath, pull the Mulat Bandha up and Udiyana Bandha in, hold, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and a nice sweeping through the electromagnetic field, feeling the energy all around you. Breathing out and now take both hands and just very lightly touch the thumbs onto the heart part of the, the cartilage and then very lightly exhale through the left side. Now close the right nostrils lightly, inhale through the left and close both nostrils. Exhale through the right side now. 
inhale through the right side and close both nostrils and tuck your chin slightly toward your chest Jaladavanda and exhale through your left inhale through your left and close both nostrils and exhale through the right Inhale through the right and then close both nostrils. Remember your thumbs keep remaining throughout the practice on your nostrils. You don't need to remove them. Just let them there and exhale through the left. Inhale through the left and retain your breath, closing both nostrils. And then exhale through the right. Inhale. Suspend your breath. Now exhale through the left. Inhale left. Comfortably holding your breath. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight eight, nine, ten, exhale right, and once more inhale right, and suspend, hold, find space, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, exhale left, and then place both Hands down, take your thumb and index finger into Gyan Mudra and just allow that space to happen here. Just connect to your natural breathing. So we circulated some energy all around our being, and connecting to ourselves. And connecting also to the other beings, to the outside world. Every time we practice, we invoke that collective feeling, collective practicing. And really relax the space between your eyebrows. We are all holding tension, relaxing the thought. And if heaviness occurs, just take a deep inhalation, roll the shoulders back, open through the heart center and the arc line, allowing that place that is sitting tight to find space to breathe. And then you can open your eyes here and just Take your thumbs, you can place the thumbs just below the pinky and we're going to work a little bit with um, our arms and that is a nice little moving meditation. So while I'm talking, you can comfortably close your eyes once you caught up and settled with the physical movement. So just inhale up and then back and then alternate the um, arms crossing across the arc line and still here really maintain that really light um, space so there is nothing no tension holding you can put on a little smile so this is really just something you can do throughout the day whenever wherever you find space a seat and then now close your eyes and let's see if we can just connect to that long deep breath and maybe even find that space to widening your arms reaching out through the electromagnetic field and really making space for the new 
sometimes we are holding on to a lot of unspoken issues and tension and we're just waiting for the right moment to approach maybe our partner in life or our partner in work or a friend so through this kind of um, breathing techniques and physical movements and allowing prana life force to freely flow maybe we will find that day that we can speak out what we want and um, really activating also through the fifth chakra vishuddha our command center so the more we are chanting and the more we activating the vocal cords the more strength we will find to speak our truth so keep on moving here roll the eyes up to find a little bit more space seeing this light in between your eyebrows that freedom and keep on moving sometimes the physical body is acting up in this case you can go a little slower